If you're looking for something to do this summer and would like to spend some great time in the great outdoors, then the trout streams of southeast Minnesota would be perfect. I recently went fly fishing, something I'd never done before. And as you will soon learn, you don't have to be a fisherman to try. On a quiet summer day, flowing through southeast Minnesota near Preston, you'll find the serenity of Camp Creek. It's one of 200 waterways in this area, creating some 700 miles of designated trout stream. I've been fishing since I could walk. Keith Sertia knows the water well. He's the director of the National Trout Center and a lifelong angler. I made this myself. When I got it, it didn't have these guides on here. He tells us 45,000 people come to this part of the state to fish for trout. He agreed to show us one of his favorite methods, fly fishing. And it's geologically unique to the world. Once we set out walking toward the water, Heath quickly told us what to watch out for. These plants right here, there's a couple different plants. This is wild parsnips and this is wood nettle. These are going to give you a stinging sensation. Which is when I realized shorts, so for the thistles, probably not the smartest choice. So I'll lift that up and just kind of dabble it out there again. Once along the creek, Heath offered some pointers. The trick of it is to slide this under your index finger. And gave me some examples of how fly fishing is done. I'm just going to lift the rod up and just flip it. I gave it a shot. You going to start over? Yep, flip her back out there. Oops. But struggled a bit. Yeah. Ugh. Not he. He hooked a trout within minutes, albeit a little small. That's what we call sardine because he's super little. But to Heath and most that fish here, it's not the size of the catch that keeps them coming back. Just ask Bob Storley. We found him along the water, spending quality time with his son. You know, we just like to get outside and see if we can catch fish. A lot of times, sometimes I'll uh, catch more weeds or snags than fish, but it's always it's always fun. So whether you're an experienced angler or someone looking to try something new. Travel to the streams of southeast Minnesota, because even if you don't catch that trophy trout, you'll certainly have a fun time trying. What is your favorite part about coming out here? Mostly everything. I agree. I think I'll be back. It was a really good time. If you'd like to learn more about fly fishing, the National Trout Center is a great resource. It offers clinics and workshops, and we put information to that on our website. Just go to KALTV.com. Well, then I apologize. For I thought that that itty bitty fish was the one you caught, so I was kind of making you fun. You just assumed that's what I, I didn't catch did. a fish at all, but I tried. And you looked great doing it. Well, thanks. <laughs> In my shorts. I was so I was like, I'm going to get bit by something, I'm going to get stung, but Heath was such a great teacher. So head on out there, contact the National Trout Center, and they will hook you up. Give it a try if you haven't done it. It was fun. You did a really good job. Thank you. I'm proud of you. I tried. Yeah.